when you have been a part of a people that has been so pr uh, persecuted, I think that sometimes uh, faith is what gives people some uh, glimpse of hope to be able to kind of continue. Um, but I also think about my people's uh, stories and histories and know that, uh, in fact, we were not taught to be resilient, but we were born into it. Sometimes faith becomes an excuse for things that are like patriarchal in practice and end up harming women and girls and LGBTQ folks. And so I think there there's a lot of that discussion, which I think young people push, right? Um, because they don't want to believe in a faith that has that kind of, uh, that doesn't allow for that kind of um, uh, uh, evolution and growth. And so, um, so I feel like I'm witnessing all the time uh, our community's uh, evolution in, in, in trying to create the world that we know is possible um, and that can care for uh, all of our communities, both in times where uh, there is extreme harm and hurt, but also uh, when things are well, how can we keep moving forward? So um, I'm taking a lot of that uh, insight and just know that uh, uh, I think other communities are, are grappling with it as well.